this is Sherry with CPR Craft Pray Repeat and I got a package from BB Craft and I wanted to share it with you I have done reviews on their products in the past and always been extremely happy with everything that I received so I'm really anxious to show you these and the first thing comes in a package like this you can see there's some bubble wrap in here because there are glass cabochons in there. These were the things I had seen and I was so excited about trying. They are absolutely gorgeous. They are bookmarks. They do come where you can use a straight line here if you need like a little to draw a line or if you need a ruler. This is in, I believe, centimeters. And there's also a little scalloped line here that if you wanted like if you're doing Bible journaling or whatnot those would be really helpful for people doing that these are the ovals and then there are also circles that go with it and the circles have um, a tiny little bow let's see if you're gonna focus for me there we go See the tiny little bow at the top? Really pretty. Love them both. And was thinking these would be great projects for Mother's Day. So I will be doing one for my mom, but I will be coming back to share that with you at a later time. And then there are the cabochons, the glass cabochons that go on the inside here. So you've already got that covered. Let's see, these, there are 16 in the set, and it says 16 round and oval clear dome glass cabochons for $8.28. And like I said, they come in the, I guess this is bronze, and then this is the silver. Really pretty, absolutely love them both. I will tighten it in here for you a little bit so you get a better look at them. And like I said, there are the glass cabochons to go on top. They would be beautiful in your Bible. Um, just a really great bookmark if you do any reading. I'm not a big reader, but I do have my books that I do my projects and stuff in. I love the detailing on the back. And so I believe they're all the same. Yeah, the detailing on the back is the same. So really pretty and I'll be back in one second to share the next thing with you all right everybody here's the next thing that I ordered from them and it comes in this plastic bag everything was really well wrapped bubble wrapped and as I showed you the other bookmarks um, this is the book that I use to keep track of my projects, inspiration, I actually have another one for prayer requests and things like that that I want to remember. If I come up with any sentiments or things that I might think I want to put inside cards, I keep track of them in a book like that. So I needed some more bookmarks and I thought, let me see, why am I stuck here? Oh, because it's taped. Huh? And it also comes taped, so apparently it is definitely not going to pop open on you. And it's got a clip here that attaches it. So, again, it's really well sealed, so you're not going to worry about your stuff being all over the place when it gets there. Is there more tape? My golly, Sherry Jean. Pay attention. Hang on. Sorry, guys. I am just not seeing well today. I think I got all the tape off. All right. The tape's on there good. So look at those. It's just beautiful. Now I haven't went to the store yet to get my, um, the ribbons I was picking, but I was really happy with the colors that I knew I was going to have to work with here. And so many pretty colors, a really pretty silver, a copper, a gold, and a bronze, and then there's a different one. 
Okay, these come, there are 400 pieces. There are five collars. They are seven millimeters wide, which I think will be perfect for three eighths inch. I'm trying to get it on there. Yep, three eighths inch, three eighth inch ribbon. It comes in an antique bronze, a gold, a silver, a platinum, and a red copper. They come with a little clip on the top here so that you can hang your, um, you know, hang embellishments off of. So it's really pretty. And then you just use a pair, a pair of flat pliers and then just pinch these together. And there's little grippy teeth here. And I will come back and do a video showing you the bookmarks that I make for those. I'm wanting to make my mom a couple different bookmarks for Mother's Day so that she can keep different spots in her Bible. These are gorgeous and are going to make beautiful bookmarks. And I will be back sharing those with you later on next week. Alright everybody, I'm going to show you these two together because I kind of picked them together for a reason. This one is two boxes, a set of assorted colors of confetti glitter and star shapes. And it's $7.20 for both sets. And let me open this up here. One ha is a solid star. And then this one here has a um, the star punched out of the center. So there are two different designs. I think they're pretty much the same colors. Just, you know, one solid and one's um, got a little circle in the center. But they're very, very tiny. And that's why I wanted them. Because I want to make these. And this is what I'm hoping I can do. And hoping it turns out. <laughs> Because I'll be really disappointed if I mess this up. Because I know what I'm looking for. It comes in a couple different pieces. And here's the main part. And these are little glass globes. They feel... No, I don't know if they're glass. I thought they were. It says glass. Okay, maybe I'm wrong. Okay, they're little glass globes, and then you've got these that go on top of them. There is a silver and what looks like a bronze. And it says antique silver caps, 15 of those, and 15 antique bronze caps. So, and then there's 30 of these, so you have a total of 60 pieces. And my plan is to fill these with tiny little confettis and maybe some tiny tiny little sequins and things and then put these lids on top to make some of my own charms out of i mean look how tiny they're so cute let me see if i can sit it upside down there we go so it's like about a half an inch is about the size of it i thought it would be a perfect size i thought if i went any bigger it would be too big and difficult to you know have around on the side of a um, a book or something and if I went any smaller it would be too hard to fill up so I'm just gonna stick those globes right back into this stuff they feel sturdy enough so I don't think I have to worry about them being so thin that they're going to break because I mean I'm kind of pushing down on them right there and not having any trouble so this is one of the things that I'll be making and I'm very excited about I'll be right back with my final two things explaining to you what I'm going to use them for and be using them in the next couple weeks for some really fun projects. I'm back with my final two products and these are two millimeter elastic cord. They call them metallic tensile elastic cord. I love the, the brightness of them. They are two millimeters in width, and there are 50 meters on each spool. I thought they would work great for traveler's notebooks, but I also plan on using them for some of my 
tags that I use for Christmas. I like that you can stretch it so you don't have to worry. I hate when I get, I don't like when you get tags in the store and they got this tiny ribbon and it's like, how am I supposed to get this, you know, around the handle of a bag? So that's always bothered me. So I like the idea. And last year after Christmas, I purchased some red um, elastic stuff like this so that I would have it. But I wanted to get some silver and gold. And this is a way better deal than what you pay for at the craft stores. Because I got 50 meters for $8.15. So it's going to last me all year long and probably next year for my Christmas crafts. And so I was really tickled. And it is the 2 millimeter thickness. So it's got a good, nice weight to it. Because I do tend to make chunky tags so I think I'm going to really like that and I will be using these for some holiday tags as well as some notebooks that I'm making to send out as gifts and I think this is going to be a really good quality um, let me try to open this one I think it's going to be really good for what I'm needing because those little rolls that you get at the craft store just don't give you enough especially if you're going to do notebooks you don't get enough of it and oh nice and thick good stretch I like it yeah I'm definitely going to like this not sure where the ear it is where the end is so there we go let's cut it and see how it does because I don't like it if it frays so no it doesn't fray that was just from where it was I yanked and pulled on it but so yeah this is going to be really good it's got a good it's soft it's not um scratchy like the stuff that I have so I'm really tickled with this I think it's going to work really well for my notebooks and my um just trying to stretch it back in there see if I can get it in and but I think it's going to work really good for the things that I've got planned for the next few months and the upcoming holidays so be on the lookout for that I will definitely be sharing those here are my little sequins again and then of course you can't really see the baubles but and the uh, bookmarks so a lot of fun things that are going to be coming here in the in the near future so please keep checking back I apologize that I haven't put up a video as of late I've been sick but God always takes care of me and he will continue to I have faith all right everybody if you like this video give it a thumbs up remember to practice your CPR craft pray repeat thanks for visiting me today and happy crafting love you all bye